Good morning. Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Um, <clears throat> welcome to Kawanda Collectibles. Today, what we're going to do is probably be a variety. It's going to be like mainly some brooches and earrings and etc. So, those who are new, welcome. If you're interested in anything, please email me at Kawanda Collectibles, the number one, at gmail.com. And please give me your full name, address, your shipping address that you want your order delivered to, um, and a, the time stamp of what you want, and a brief description of what you want, of the item that you want. And um, what else? I do PayPal and my shipping is $5. So, again, welcome and thank you for coming out to watch my video. So, we're going to start with some brooches. Well, wait, do I want to start with the brooches? Well, yeah, I'll go ahead and start with some of these. This one is number eight. <coughs> Excuse me. This is a crown trafari. This is pretty. And this is the back. And this is eight. Eight dollars. Then we have here number nine. Um, this is a no name brand. This is I know I didn't see anything on here. This is three. It's a beautiful gold leaf, though. Then there's the back and the front. And I tried to clean it. It has some red um, stuff on it. I wasn't sure what it was, but as you can see, I took, took it off. It's beautiful. And this is three, number nine. This is number two. It's the breast cancer. Um, Pen. This one is a pen. And they are in good condition, though, in the back. All of them. That's $3. And then we have this one here. I couldn't find a name on the back of it, but the back is in excellent condition. And this the front. Very pretty. This number 10. This brooch is. It's $3. And this, the breast cancer brooch, number two, that's $3. The leaf is number nine, which is $3. And the crown trafari is number eight, which is $8. So, now I'm going to show maybe um, some other items. Um, let's see. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to show some other brooches. I, you guys know how I like to write down my items. Um, okay, this one here, this brooch. It's beautiful. I love it. And it's glass. I tested the glass on it. Let me see how it would do. See? It's definitely all glass. Ooh, ooh. And sometimes with this Presidium, you have to be careful when you press down on these rhinestones and stuff because you're going to actually pop one out. Let's see, so these, these are glass. And this the back. It's a bow. And I think this is how it's supposed to be. It has a little movement to it because I look at it real good. It doesn't look like it's broken or anything, but it has a little movement to it, the bow on top. And this was 15. 
at that. It's beautiful. I cleaned them all. Let's do that. It's a big brooch. Then we have um I think I got them mixed up here. I have a Roman brooch gold. Wait, I'm getting them mixed up. Gold with the pearls. No, I didn't do that one. Let me see. No, let me see. Let me see. Uh, curly. Okay. Here you go. I got a mix. Okay, this one is a curly vintage brooch most of my vintage this is a vintage brooch this one is twelve dollars and it's of the american flag very new excellent condition this is the back and here's the front excellent condition a glass and this is 12. Beautiful brooch. Love the enamel on it. And this is a Caralee vintage brooch. I am hot. <laughs> okay. Um, then we have a Roman vintage bow brooch this is twelve dollars this is an excellent condition as well but is missing one of the glass stones right let me see it's probably up here somewhere up top but this is beautiful too and this is the back and this is twelve Beautiful brooch, bow brooch. Okay, and then um, uh, curly. I did that one. I'm coming, everyone. I do apologize, but trying to get everything in the order that I have it this one is a brooch as well it's a two flower brooch this one is 10. these i were going to put on my etsy but never got to doing it so the items that no one buy i probably actually list on etsy and some of them probably be a higher amount once I put them on Etsy, I'm not sure. Or Poshmark, I'm not sure. Because I look some items up and they are higher than what I would charge them. And But this is pretty. I love the pearls. Double flower brooch. This is the back. And there's the brooks. I said brooks on the back. And this is 10. And I want to say, I like to try to show everything. But I thought I... I think it's a little nick on here, right over there. But other than that, this is an excellent brooch for 10. And some of the brooches I saw for 20. <coughs> Excuse me. Then I have, I'm trying to go in the order of what I have done in. Then I have a Closure Nay Hyperallergenic pair of new earrings. Brand new. Hyperallergenic. And here's the, the back. Let me just take one off. And 
and they're in good condition. These are brand new. These are eight dollars. <coughs> Excuse me. Then I have this one. This is twelve. This is a circa circa C I R C A brooch, but what this brooch is, it does not have a signature marking on it. And I searched for and searched for it, but when I found it on, I want to say I found it on Etsy or one of the um, sites. And it's it also a lot of them said it's not a signed brooch. It's a beautiful brooch, so I'm shocked that it doesn't have a signature marking on it. But this is a freshwater pearl, and it's a pearl on the inside. This one I know is the freshwater pearl, and this is $12. This is beautiful. And I think I saw this one for like 20 and 25. Okay, then I have, um, I'm trying to go in my order that I have them in. Yeah, I did a Brooks one. Um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Um, I did a fresh water pearl one, so that was 12. Oh, okay. I knew it. Okay, now we have this one I love. This is a vintage 1980s orchid flower. It's a two-tone pink enamel. And this one is 15. Beautiful. New without tags. It's brand new. Never been used. Here's the back. Here's the front. Pretty. And this is 15. Then I have a pair of Bohemian glass earrings. These are new without tags, too. And these are $4. These are pretty. Here's the back. I, um, they are in good condition, though, but I'll take it off. And these are four dollars, you guys. And also, I'm gonna try to do a um, a drawing today. Um, I'm gonna pick a video. I'm not sure which video, but I will pick a video. I'm gonna. Oh, there are my birds. I love it. I will. Um, the birds got me off track. I will do two drawings today. I'm excited about that, and I don't know which video I'm gonna pick yet to do the drawing on. So. These are $6. With these, I have to fix. One of them I have to fix. This one, as you see, need the posting on it. Okay. That's how they look, though. And this one on the back is worn on the back. But other than that, it's in good condition. These gonna be six. They close your name. Look at that. And here, this one is fine on the back. I just have to fix that. Then we have an. This pair is Vintage Floral Round Closure Nay. These are 10. These are pretty much new as well. I will be taking 
these off and cleaning the back so because you get and they're very hard to take off the um the post because these are new no one has worn these See the back and here's the front these are beautiful really beautiful and those are 10 <clears throat> and then I have some Trafari earrings they're clip-ons these are eight dollars the regular price was $18.50 I love this blue and look it looks like clouds inside I love these these are clip-ons and how much I said these were these are eight dollars and the regular price were eighteen fifty. so these are eight and here's the back never been worn um, and then I have these they call B E R E B I is it berry B dangling burgundy and black enamel earrings i thought these were 32 and these are eight excellent condition let's put them on here i love these as well look at that and here's the back And these are eight dollars. Then I have a pair of Damascene fan earrings, screwbacks. And these are 15. Excellent condition as well, but they they are in good condition. I cleaned the screw backs off some. These are beautiful. Look at that. I love the black and gold. And this. This the back. And I cleaned them up some. And these are 15. Then I have this Mary Kay 50th Anniversary Globe. This is um, $6. Excellent condition. I love the rhinestone on there. I see that black and gold is pretty. Then it opens. And on the inside, it says, One Woman Can. We put some your jewelry in here and I love the design on it around it too on the inside and I love the design on around here it's pretty this is six then I have some closure bangles they are four dollars a piece we have the green pair have the white I have the blue the red and then we have the black and these are four dollars a piece And then for eight dollars, I have a Clojure stretch stretch bracelet. This is eight dollars. This is really pretty too. Now I saw it on one of the websites, and on the inside it had one of them had silver spacers. But this one doesn't. And is in excellent condition. And this is eight dollars. 
And then we have a, these are 15. These are, okay, I think I skipped these. Okay, these are the Damascene hang down earrings. And again, these are also, I showed it back. These are in excellent condition as well. And what you may see here is just like, it's just a design on the front that shows that right there. I don't know if you can see that. But as you can see too, the earrings are in, the backings are in excellent condition. And let me show you the front. The front is beautiful. I love them. And I have more. I will show those in another video. I have more Domicine earrings. Look at that. That's pretty. I love that black and gold. And it looks like an eagle or some birds. That's pretty. These are 15. And again, that's the back. Okay. Finish with that tray. What's next on my list here? Okay. We're going to show... A mixture of earrings. Some are Avon. And some have other names on them. These are the earrings. A few earrings that I'm going to show. Um, we have this one right here. I tested the jade. Um, I have vintage. It's an Avon. It's a seven and a half. Beautiful. The rings are eight. Vintage earrings. And you guys... I tell people, don't sleep on Avon products. Avon jewelry and the products also are, are very good. They are very good. And the jewelry lasts a long time. And actually, some of their jewelry do not turn. And I can check that you see. It's so slippery. Yeah, okay, now it doesn't want to do it. Let's try it again. Do it right there. See, now I don't want to do it. Okay, well, it goes past that, though, the glass. Let me try it again. See, it goes past the glass, but this is eight, and it's a size seven and a half. Then I have this one. I want to say this was Avon too. Let me see. This is a vintage statement Avon ring. Beautiful. Look at that. Look at the sides. Nice. And this is $8 and it's a size 8. And it's glass. See, it moves up. There we go. And so, this is $8 as well. I love it. Then, this one is a six and a, a size six midnight rose ring, 1981. It's $8 as well. I like the size of these rings. And see, this is an Avon ring in excellent condition. Then we have a vintage Avon cameo ring. Wait a minute, is this Avon? This might be. Yeah, this is a vintage Avon cameo ring. Beautiful. Look at the sides. And got pearls around it. The sides are beautiful. I love it. And then inside, I forget what you call these. Maybe it was too big and someone had to put in the... um. Had to have it sized. 
and this is a pretty cameo ring. And I thought I had the earrings, but I'm not sure. And this is $8 as well. Then we have, okay. I thought this one was a beauty. This is seven and a half. Filig filigree vintage flora ring. And this one is a, I wanna say this is a Avon as well. Let me see. Yeah, this is an Avon one too. This one is pretty. I like that. And that's eight. Then we have this one. It's eight dollars too. It's a filigree. Nineteen seventy-seven vintage ring. Eight and a half. This is pretty, and all the rings are in excellent condition. And this is another one that looked like was sass, or either it was made like this, I'm not sure. Then we have a gold butterfly ring, excellent condition too. This is $8, and it is a seven and a half. And of course, they all sign Avon. That's $8 too. Oops. Drop the little butterfly. Then I have this one. It's a dollar. I'm not sure. Let me see. I'm not sure what this one was. I couldn't see a jewelry marking on it, but it's a dollar. And you can see the stone. It's this one there. And it's a size. Didn't put the size on it. I'm glad I bought this with me though. It's a seven and a half. And then we have a 1978 Love Me Not ring, a knot ring. And it has a little, this is eight, it has a little rhinestone in there. It's glass. That's pretty. That's eight. Um, and this one here, I don't know what this M is. This one is a five and a half. It's very small. Hey. I can't see the signature mark on here, but it has an M on it. Uh, that this one be before that's pretty uh, holding the M wrong no yeah then we have a vintage Sarah Cove night 1976 or 96 I can't read my own writing but it's a beauty this is a size 8 And this is $8 as well. Then we have this one. This is a Cove, eight size 8. This is $8 to excellent condition. And I don't think. Oh, yeah, it moves. Yeah, it moves on. Um, yeah, so I think this is glass or enamel, but it moved. Then we have this beauty I love. This is $8. This is a vintage orange stone. I think it's, it's um, Avon. Dang. So it does move. Moves just a little bit. I'm not sure. It could be enamel. It's a size eight, and this is eight dollars as well. It's a vintage Avon ring, and inside looked like someone had it sized as well. But when I sized, it was an eight. And this one, my beauty, I love this one. This eight dollars as well, and this one is an eight to an eight and a half. 
and it's a vintage. This one says, I can't even know how to see it. 1970 CZ filigree ring. This is a beauty. This is $8. Look at that. And that's the inside. And all of these are in excellent condition. And then after this, I have just a few more brooches. And then we have this one. I love this one. But this one is marble amber. And it's a Sarah Cub 7 inch, seven, size 7. And that's the. And. Hmm. Yeah, and it moves. It's saying it's glass. And this is $8 as well. I think I just was having all the rings 8 But that's pretty. Oh, and this is an adjustable one. Let's see if you can see that right, right here. I don't know if you can see it. It's an adjustable ring. Okay, that was it for the rings. Let me show more of the other few brooches that I have. I have this one. Let me go back to my, my book. This one is a vintage 1950s Queen Nefertiti um, pen, and it has Spain on the back. This is 10. And this is this side. It says Spain. And I tried... It had also some like red marking on it. I tried to get it off, but it looked like someone, I don't know, it's a little red on it in the front part. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that. I don't know if you can see that red in there, but this is pretty. And it's the, you can tell it's vintage because of this, the pen, that closure. It's very different the way the closure is on here. And this pen looks like it's okay. You pull this over. There you go. So it's like a lock pen. So you can tell this is very vintage because I've never seen it thing made like this. I don't know if you can see that. But this is 10. And this is a number six. Then I have this one here. This is number five. This three dollars. What do you call these? The um um some with what the sun, the smiling sun, <laughs> and it's missing a stone on one of the eyes. And look the back, excellent. And this three dollars, and this number five. Um, I was trying not to go too over. And I love this. This is a Monet. And this one here is $5. A vintage filigree um, butterfly. Excellent condition here. Beautiful. That's the back. Excellent condition. Beautiful. And that was number four. Then I have a Sarah Cuff. This is three. Couldn't really find a price on this. It could be worth, I don't know. And this is number seven, and it's $3. I love the gold and the rose. And it's in excellent condition. And then this the number seven. We got two more. This one and another one. And that would be it. This one here. Uh, the back is in excellent condition as well, as you can see. This one is three. And the number is number three. This is a beauty. It's a brooch as well with a full pearl. And then our last one. Uh, I didn't do this one. 
I want like the Nora's art. I think it is. No, no, this is three dollars. Look how beautiful that filigree is. That's pretty, and the back is also in excellent condition. I don't want to take it off the thing, but it's three dollars. So that's gonna be it for today. And everyone, enjoy the rest of your Sunday. Um, and again, if interested, email me at Kawanda Collectibles, the number one, at gmail.com. Um, and before you order anything, maybe just go ahead and almost like a pre-register, email me your information at Kawanda Collectibles, one at gmail.com with your email address. I mean, your, yeah, your email if you like, and and your um, shipping address. So that way, if you order anything, it already will be in there. So when I do your invoice, I can send it to you and I have to keep trying to reach out to everyone as far as giving me your information. So again, have a blessed day. Bye-bye.